Hi, this is Raja and welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the auto completion problem in Visual Studio when working with Unity. Now a lot of you have faced this problem at some point of time and I have I keep receiving this message, this comment in different videos of mine that auto completion doesn't work. So in my case, as you can see, if I write transform dot, you will see I can see all the functions inside this class. If I write rigid body, I can already get suggestions but in your case you might not get these suggestions and that's the problem you have to fix so let me show you how to do it so first of all you should have visual studio installed of course and you should have unity installed of course as you can see in my case unity is installed so if auto completion doesn't work it doesn't matter but you should have Unity installed now you're gonna open up the visual studio go to tools get tools and features and yes now from this tools and features tab you have to install one feature that will fix all the problems now in my in your case it might check for updates and you might have to update something but i'm not going to go ahead and update anything right now because i'm going to go to the go to download it directly so you can go down below and as you can see in the mobile and gaming section i have this game development with unity feature right here so in my case as you can see a tick mark is here that means it is installed already but in your case it is probably not installed and that's why you are facing the problem so you can simply select it and as you can see in your case this optional will be selected in the beginning as well but since you have unity installed from before you can simply uncheck it you only need this option then you can simply go ahead and click on modify as you can see in my case it is saying close because I already have this downloaded but in your case it will say modify so once you click on modify it will go ahead and install it and before that it will ask you to close your visual studio and save the project okay so you can simply save the project, close Visual Studio and click on modify to update your Visual Studio and install this Unity tools. Okay, so once you have done, you need to do one more step. Once you have that Unity 2D plugin installed, now you need to go back to Unity and from here you need to go to edit, preferences, external tools this external tools part and as you can see in my case in the external script editor visual studio community 2017 is already selected so in your case after you have installed the tools you will get the option to select this one so you can simply go ahead and select this one and now visual studio is selected as your default code editor so now doesn't matter whatever you do all your code will work and all the auto completion will work and if it still doesn't work you can simply click on browse and browse the folder where you have this visual studio installed and select the visual studio file so that it gets selected as your default code editor so this is all you need to do to make visual studio work with unity and fix all your problems so i hope after this video all your problems will be solved because i am i was receiving a lot of messages about this that the auto completion is not working so go ahead and do these steps and i'm sure that your problems will be solved so thank you so much for watching this video this is raja and i hope you really enjoyed and this video helped some of you so thanks for watching and i'm going to see you with a new video soon